the Maine Artists Collective is a nonprofit organization um, that has a, a mission to support artists through uh, classes and professional workshops and to also support through um, studio space and, and space where artists can display their work. Constellation Gallery uh, started a, a little over four years ago. Uh, about a year ago, we formed the, uh, the main artist collective, um, and that organization took over operations of Constellation Gallery um, in uh, about six months ago. So that was in July of 2012. At some point, David was proposing to change to a collective instead of he being the owner of the gallery. So we formed a, a team. Uh, it exploded in, in, in growth. I think we have now about 40 members. And several of us have a studio space. This is my space. We have uh, nine different studios in the gallery right now. They're all sort of open format and um, artists will pay fees on a monthly basis in order to be able to access those studio spaces. A collective um, is generally a, a group of artists that have sort of a, a common mission of, uh, to work on something together. Um, in this case, you know, our mission is uh, an educational mission and also to really connect a uh, main artist to the public. I like the idea of collective ownership just because um, you know, when you can get a group of artists together um, a lot of ideas are exchanged and um, then you get a, a really interesting product out of that. So um, I can say personally my own art has grown from my relationships and experience and you know, just being surrounded by other, the work of other artists. Well, besides having a, a space or the opportunity to have art in downtown Portland, it's stimulating to be surrounded with people that have the same mindset. Instead of sitting in your own little cellar or whatever, whatever your studio is, and it's, it's, it's a stimulus. On a monthly basis, we do a call for art and we have a new show lined up and artists that are members can submit images to be considered for those shows. You have a, the possibility to have a permanent exhibition and you can do whatever you want. You can change it, you can join the main gallery with uh, rotating exhibitions. Every month there's another theme. Artists that would like to join the Main Artist Collective um, just need to fill out a, a simple membership application and then we have a $50 annual fee and um, that fee can be reduced for people under certain income levels and um, that annual fee allows artists to submit images for our upcoming shows and also we have a website and um, each artist gets a page on the website in order to upload images. Artists who are members can propose um, class ideas um, so that way we can have classes in here and um, uh, bring in you know, other members or members of the public who are interested in participating in those classes. Some artists will come in and do things like focus on cleaning and other artists work on doing promotions. Some artists will work on website building. So all those different parts of, uh, of uh, the gallery uh, we're able to pull together uh, and support with volunteer hours. So far the vast majority of hours I'd say um, 90 95 percent of the hours that have gone into the gallery have been uh, volunteer. Really uh, to have a sense of ownership for each person who's participating because at the end of the day you know your work is benefiting the the group and um, the, a lot of artists really enjoy that philosophy. We're in the process right now of setting up our annual uh, schedule for events that we want to have. One is going to be an international event where we um, try to uh, bring together people um, who have come to uh, you know, Portland and Maine uh, more, more recently um, and were born in uh, countries around the world and also sol solicit artwork from uh, people who live in other countries. Also we're planning on having another uh, annual art show for uh, Southern Maine Community College. Uh, last year we partnered with uh, SMCC in order to do their senior art exhibition. 
the, the main artist collective has actually been attracting a lot of artists from, uh, from around the world. We have artists in here who are originally from uh, the Netherlands or Iraq or Russia or Germany. And uh, that's been a really exciting thing for us because we've got a lot of uh, new ideas coming together. Our, our website is um, uh, mainartist.org and uh, people can check us out there and we're located at 511 Congress Street in Portland, Maine. I think Portland is, uh, is a little bit the hub of, of the Northeast if it comes to art. Um, of course I've seen other places. And, but in this region it's, it's amazing how much art there is. When you come around um, downtown Portland, you see um, life on the streets. Um, you know the artists are out there uh, selling their art on the streets. Uh, you know during the summer, um, and also you know creating work outside. Um, it's really brought a lot of life to our arts district. It's part of the society, art in many ways, and it can be performing, it can be visual arts or whatever. It's it's basic for life, and. It's, so the more art, the better. Portland's often cited as being, you know, uh, you know, the top in various categories, and you know, I think the cultural aspect of the city is one of the the big uh, shining stars.